resuming from where we left off, obviously. More mind history. And what was I working on? I know I had got my sorting figured out. Wave 81, I've been informed, is the next big boss. Interesting that 75 is when I can launch. Plan is not to launch at all, though. I don't know if this boss is going to be ground or air, but either way, it'll probably be kind of scary. These only work versus ground. But they do awesome versus large waves. If it's air, I just want to have stupid amounts of guns all over the place, I think. I wouldn't mind having more of these building robots, just because they also assist me. Next launch opportunity won't be until wave 90. Why am I not shipping off this excess? I should be doing that. Large launch pad. Yeah. Because there are vaults here too. So the main thing will be to only do it as an overflow. We'll do two overflows. I think one will be sufficient, but just in case. Seems like one's sufficient. That way these keep mining. Where else is stuff backing up? I want to go check if this is almost full of any other supplies. So we already know about titanium. Lead and copper are not surprising. Beyond that, not really. And I should look at my tech tree. That's not how to do it. Hit escape, tech tree. What else can I unlock? Not this because I need surge alloy. I really have zero. Oh, I'm not shipping it off. It's just in my container. I need to ship some of it off. I'm surprised. Okay, so yeah, in the container I have 3.8k thorium. Cool. But I've shipped off 59,000 already in this one playthrough. Phase conduit. Advanced liquid transport block uses power to teleport liquids to a connected phase conduit over several tiles. That sounds cool. RTG generator, that's going to be... I think the thing that I already have? No, maybe not. A simple, reliable generator uses heat of decaying radioactive compounds to produce... Maybe that is what I already have. Impact reactor. That requires a lot of surge alloy. Fortress mech factory. Ooh. That sounds super promising. That might be what I try and build next. Advanced support mech. Hmm. wonder... If that's like for healing stuff. Alpha, Delta. I only want other flying ones, really. Interceptor. That sounds like it might be a flying one. It's funny that I'm short lead. And silicone and other stuff. Phase conveyor. There we go. Advanced item transport block uses power to teleport items to... A connected phase conveyor over several tiles. That sounds promising. I'm almost at the point where, like, everything's unlocked. I need to send off some of this surge alloy. What does this even do? Oh yeah, that's that long range. I've read that like three times. Meltdown. This was mentioned. A massive laser cannon. Charges and fires a persistent laser beam at nearby enemies. Requires coolant to operate. This sounds awesome. I need lead. I need silicone. I need surge alloy. Cool. So one of the things I need to do 
is I need to send off some of this surge alloy that's being produced super slow. I guess don't pause. These large launch pads could handle that. So let's get a router and take half of this. Okay, I totally just screwed that up. Now let's get a router, take half of this. And really, I need to up this production, but I need more silicon to actually make it down here. A big part of the problem is that I'm shipping so much of my silicon. But I do need a bunch of it shipped too. I just need to create more. And I want guns. I want all the things at once. This doesn't have as many guns as I would like. Okay, so if it's going to be anything other than ground, if it's going to be air basically, I guess those are the only two options there, then I might be fine. Even though these guns aren't the best, I just have so many of them scattered all over the place that I think I'll be alright. Oh, I know what I wanted to build. That new mech. I wanted a Titan mech factory. Wait, I already had a Titan. I wanted a fortress mech factory. This requires lead, thorium, and silicone. Wait. Yes. A bunch of lead. <laughs> the lead is... Oh, that's so sad. I just noticed that I did this after my air blast drill. Hold on. Problem solved. And now there's a reason to have two of these overflow gates. Okay, I need lead. This is easy to get, the thorium. And silicone. Those three things are not close by each other at all. Well, I do have lead that I'm putting into these guns. I do have thorium right here. So I can get those two pretty easy. Let's take these off. And I have more thorium up here. And silicone. These solar panels are just getting in my way. So I want these fortress mech factories. Three of them. And... Although I'm already starved for silicone down the road, I want sorter. I think that's. It's always 50 50 for if this is the direction I want it to go. Yes, that is. We'll get routers. One, two. I'll put the router here just so that it's symmetrical and I can copy and paste if I need to. The only thing is, if this backs up, I think it'll back up the whole line. So, I also want... An underflow or an overflow? Feels like overflow, but yeah, that is what I wanted to put it back. Except that I have that stupid thing there. This time I'm actually going to reconnect my power. I'm not going to forget it just because it's been two whole seconds. And I'll connect these up. Okay, so now we need 
Wait, why is it graphite and lead? I could have swore that's not what it said. What is a revenant fighter factory? Getting distracted. It's silicone and graphite. Why did I... Oh, these are the build cost. That's both good and bad. The graphite... I don't have any coal up here. I should almost just get coal. There are ways to do it. Or I can run it from this. Ah, oh, those are the two choices. I'm just gonna take it from this. But I really should be upping my graphite. Let's see. This is going to be a sorter. Set to graphite. And... I will put the overflow right here and set it to go back to the belt if it backs up that far. <laughs> Only problem is I'm wasting all this graphite to fill up the belt just to get it up to that one robot factory. Oh, good stuff. There's more lead right here! Okay, hold on. I have to destroy this. I might need this lead. Almost certainly do. We're at wave 78. I want these robots before wave 81. Why is the graphite not making its way? It is making its way. Okay. kind of overcomplicated this because I thought that <laughs> there were going to be more materials than this. And I just need a router right here, I believe. Ooh, this makes three of these fortress mechs. They build kind of slow, though. Luckily, they are building. Materials are filling up. Okay, what other mechs can I make? Let's pause, because the wave is coming somewhat soon. Revenant Fighter Factory. Ooh, produces heavy missile-based units. This sounds cool. Needs silicone and titanium. That seems doable. Where do I have titanium? I have silicone right here. Going to those guns. Titanium right here. I also need to check and make sure that this isn't doing crazy things to my power. Ooh, it kind of is. I need more power. Are there more areas that I can put those thermal generators? I also just need to build I don't even know what my options are. Beyond thermal, there is steam. I could build more thorium reactors. That actually seems pretty good. I don't know how much cryo I should just look at. Takes 2.4 per second. And these two, I don't even know where those are. Or no, this Cryo Mixer. I don't even know where that is. It would be under factory, probably. Cryo Mixer. 
it creates 24, so a ton. And it just takes water and titanium, so this can supply more reactors easily. If anything goes wrong, then let's make it go wrong big. Ooh, these take a while to build. RTG generators. A reliable, simple generator. Input thorium or phase pad fabric. Where does it say how much it generates? 180 per second. These are going to be way more. These are 840. But these also blow up. As a worst case scenario, they blow up. Okay, finish building it and pause. I want cryofluid. I don't want it to leak. Let's get these plated conduits. Think I need to use router. I'm going to use the bridge conveyor here. I guess we'll just delete this. Rebuild it. Okay, we have plenty of cryofluid. Now, all I need is a router another router, and some belts. In theory, that should get me tons more power. It does. Let's just make sure this thing's keeping up with the cryofluid. They're slowly climbing. Scares me a little. Nah, no, we're good. I mean, there should be tons of it. In theory. In theory scares me a little. Okay. Now these. I don't know how much power they take. But the main thing is, they need their silicone, they need their... this stuff. Why did I build this one all the way down here? Let's just make two and give them more room than I'm currently giving them. I guess there was plenty of room. Whatever. Put a router right here. Run a belt backwards. Here, we'll go to right here. I can still put that other one back. We'll do that. And the other side will get silicone. Need the junction. Let's put it back. Is that what this is? I don't even know what these things are. Kind of hoping they're flying units, but they probably aren't. One problem is, kind of actually want this to go into the last one first. Because we don't have long before the next wave. I just saw a small problem that will feed out onto this belt, which it is doing. I don't think that'll back anything up. No, it should be fine. But it's not what I want. Okay, why are these all backed up? Because it doesn't take that. It takes silicone. Of course. So, let's just rebuild it all. 
because I don't know what was clogged inside of there. This one just got enough titanium. Oh, I'm missing one belt here. Also, I need to handle overflow. Otherwise, this will back up and block this whole path. If it overflows, put it back. And by put it back, I mean with a junction. Wave 80. Come on, you guys can start building one. Oh, it needs power. Power, power, power. Okay, let's go see where my fortress guys were. Okay, one thing's worrying me. They're not going to attack even though a wave just came. I think I need a command center. Ooh, I also want this overdrive protect projector. Okay, isn't there some kind of command? Yes, I don't know how this works yet. I should read about it. Okay, that music's really intense. If I move away, it still keeps playing. Issues movement commands to allied units across the map causes units to rally, attack an enemy corps, or retreat, blah blah blah. When no enemy corps present, units will default to patrolling under the attack command. Okay, let's just build it right here then. Okay, I don't know what... Oh, retreat, attack, rally. Oh, it's rallying them all right here. That's not really where I want it then. Hold on. We have time. I would like it up here. Except they're not going to be able to get to here. That's okay. Rally or attack? Yes, rally. What does attack do? Rally seems cool. I didn't even know I had all those flying guys. Or is this rallying like my miners? Ooh, that new flying guy, that's one of these. Revenant, whatever. I like those. Where did my ground guys go? They're over here, trying to path and failing. <laughs> Maybe I should put it where they can actually get to it. Bam, everybody scatter. Where was it? Not in here. Command center. Let's put it right here. What else was there? What are these? Oh, mech pads for me to change into. I could try those. Overdrive projector. I want to see how that works. Maybe I should just read how that works. <clears throat> Let's see. Increases the speed of nearby buildings. Optionally uses Fave's fabric to boost range and efficiency. Power used 210 per second. Wow, this thing seems super powerful. Like, does it work on these? It does. I'm pretty sure it does. Okay, we got our boss. It's two of those giant guys. Hold on. You, attack? That was beautiful. 
I need more of these flying revenant guys. I feel like I've overprepared at this point. Overdrive projectors seem like when you mix them with power stuff. Yeah, it just went from 240 to 3 whatever. They pay for themselves. This is insane. Do they work on guns? I don't know how to tell. Force projectors are not overdrive projectors are now like one of my favorite things, I think. I should check my power use, but... Dude, I have tons of extra power. And I can make more power using these things. These things feel so cheaty if they don't even, uh, like, increase the consumption. I definitely want them here. Keep picking the wrong thing. I could get more coal, and I think I can get more graphite being produced from that coal. I should have actually looked at, like, drill speed 0.48. Should have looked at what it was. Oh, this isn't powered up, so I can look at it. Yeah, I think it went from 0.48 to 0 0.72. Which, these guys are just short coal, really. What else, what else? Could up these guys. They're not as crucial. Lead I could upgrade. Could also set this lead to an overflow. Should do that. Overflow gate. If you're overfilled... I just want you to go to right here, but I would like that to be a junction. This. Now I have to check, am I sorting off lead? I'm not. Oh. I kind of don't want to deal with it right there, so instead... Well, no. Hold on. Yeah, I'm just going to do it this way because I'm lazy. Junction. Belt going up. You're going to be led. And you're going to feed into yet another ship off thing. Launch pad. Large launch pad. I feel like I've built too many of these launch pads, probably. Probably not even using them to their full extent yet. Do I really have this much lead? Okay, I shouldn't be doing it the way that I'm doing it. I should really just be running its own belt. Hold on. Junction. Junction. I'm also going over scrap, but I don't think I'm going to need this scrap at this point. Maybe I will. We'll try and go in between it when we can. I should really stop pausing so much because I want to get to the next boss waves at this point. I feel prepared. Maybe I'm overconfident. Okay, this is my problem. This stupid router. I just need a junction there. I was wondering why it was supplying so much lead. It should have just been the overflow. But I can increase my... Ah, it's not worth increasing that little bit of lead mining. It's not worth increasing that. Ooh, I know what it is worth increasing. 
these guys are worth increasing. Even though I only have two of them right now. I need more of the stuff. The only problem is the it's their limiting factor is the silicone which I just don't have. So, I need to increase silicone production. Why is this last one not building? It has power. It should be getting all of the materials, but it's not getting Is this blocked for some reason? I bet I polluted it somehow. Okay, now it's getting the stuff it wants. So these are like my favorite guys now. I should actually build them another. Cool. Power's still doing beautifully. What else do I want to speed up? Ooh, I want to speed up these for sure. Sand? I don't actually need more sand. I have a stupid amount of sand. These could be speeded up though. The phase weaver guys. So I might need to do it where the scrap is. Yes. We'll go under it. Don't pause. I went from not pausing at all to now I pause like every time I go to do anything. Why are these mixed? What have I done? And are there some inside of these junctions? Probably. Why does it keep doing this? Okay, what am I missing? I don't understand. Maybe it was just backed up inside of there. At some point you gotta run out. Okay, now I just need to replace this junction, I think. That would have been the easier thing. I should have just replaced these junctions. This is all, like, confusing. But it's working, except that these guys aren't moving. Why do I go to pause every time? I saw some of the thorium, but it made it in. It, okay. It's because of this router right here. I missed needing a junction right there. I can't. And again, I keep pausing. I made such a mess out of this. Okay, that one still seems to be running even though I saw some thorium go through it. Yeah, 
want a junction here. <laughs> so close to having this fixed. Wonder how long that's been screwed up. What is going on? I'm assuming it's just stuff that was still stuck in these distributors. No, there's still more pink getting on here. From these ones. God damn it. Oh, I quit. What did I do that I just screwed that up? Or has that been screwed up the whole time? It's because I added one more of these units to the end on both sides. That's what happened. That was a while ago. I wonder if these have been down that whole time because of that. They have been. That's why my sand has looked so full. So I actually do need to speed up my sand production again. Okay. F. Beautiful. <laughs> why is there a fabric on this one? Why does it keep doing that? Let's put a junction there. The problem being, it can now shoot the fabric out this way. <laughs> Catch that piece of fabric. Okay. What was I doing to get this all to work now? Like this? I think so. What the hell is going on? I feel like I'm going crazy. Just work! Ah. <laughs> uh. I saw a phase fabric. Oh, I see it. It's... Okay, so the key takeaway here is just give things space. Don't do craziness. Because this is about to get backed up again. This is such a mess. I'm afraid to even say it should all be working now, but it sh should all be working now. Okay. I need more sand. I can get more sand. I just need overdrive projector. I also want Let's just say this will be an overflow gate. Maybe I don't want that an overflow gate. Maybe I just want that a straight up router. You'll also be a router. I could increase my slag production, but I mean, I have a lot of slag. I think part of it is I would like these guys to just come out down here. Actually go this way and go straight in right there.
I'm looking before I put down a distributor to make sure that this doesn't touch anything crazy. <laughs> Let's put down router right here. Okay, the slag's flowing. And it seems like I do need more of it, if I can get it. Which I can. Just need to get power over to this guy. Bam. Now, these guys, I don't really have enough. I don't have enough lead, for one. Battery diodes, all kinds of good stuff. Overdrive projector. Gotta get power to it. I'm abusing these like crazy. The only other thing would be, I could replace these with the better miners, and then I could get water going to those miners too. That would be pretty big. Or I could just source lead from elsewhere. What's going on here? Why are you doing this? An unloader doesn't work like that. An unloader works like that. Should eventually... S yeah, get rid of that backup. Cool. Sand is being produced. I have a stupid amount of coal up here that I'm not really making use of, and I should be. Where are those, like, teleportation belts? We're up to wave 89. Phase conveyors. Ooh. These seem cool. Do they just handle any amount of material instantly? Could I just get, like, this sand to go wherever I want it to? Bet I can. Except I have that backwards. And these do require power, so... I don't know if I want that just to get sand out here. Especially since I am kind of making use of this sand. That was more just a test to see if it actually worked as I was expecting. But, I, I mean, I could just take the sand out right here, too. I could make more silicone using sand and coal, and I could get this coal out of here using those without it being as much of a mess. I can use regular belts, too. We're at 44 minutes. I should end this recording for now. But, yeah, I feel like this has been... A good video I've learned some things I got to get more silicone down to these that's more silicone next time hopefully I'll remember that we'll see or I'll get distracted and do other stuff <laughs> all right thanks for watching